Greetings and salutations, guys. Heater here. Welcome to our live sale this Thursday, April 18, 2024. How is everyone doing today? Hope you guys are all doing fantastic. Happy Thursday. If you guys are watching this video after it's already over, you check down below in the description box items, availability, and the pricing of the items are going to be down there. And if you're watching this for the first time or you're in, out on the live sales or to the channel for the first time, welcome. My name is Heater. I'm so happy to have you here. Welcome to the Thrift Squad. All the sale info is going to be right here around me. Um, so you can read that and um if you can't read it we can check down below in the description box as well for all that information but hi guys how is everyone doing today hi linda sorry i was just talking to my mom she was giving me some clothing items that uh she was going through her closet and because she is trying to pack right now for when we go to hawaii and she had she says she has a lot more and she's going to give me them soon she just didn't get a chance to go through everything, but she gave me a good pile of stuff. So we're going to have some of mom's clothes. Um, you, a lot of this stuff is size um, large, extra large, size um, size 12 or 14. They're mostly blouses and tops, and they're like summery, springy tops. So they're really, really pretty. Some of them are new with tags. So <laughs> yeah, it's awesome. But hi, guys. How is everyone doing today? Hi, Linda. Uh, oh, I got to change this out. You guys have to help me think of a giveaway question as well. We're giving away, this is a Trina Turk uh, double zip like makeup pouch. It's super cute. It's black and white and it has like a blue zipper with gold hardware. Super fun. I love a good pouch. You guys already know. You can put, um, it's like kind of padded inside so you can use this as a sunglass case. I actually really think this is a really good sunglass case because a lot of people um, if they have like eyeglasses, you have like prescription sunglasses too. This has two little sections. So if you have like different glasses, like my dad, he has like 30 different pairs of glasses. He keeps them all in his pocket and they're all scratched <laughs> all the time. This is like actually really, really good for that. So what time is you? I'm going to Atlanta to visit my family right now. The forecast is a rainy day and the low 80s where I'm at. <gasps> Oh, Linda, that's so exciting that I can't believe we're both going to be on vacation at the same time, but that's going to be so fun to visit your family. Um, we, so, I think I can fit pretty much everything in a carry-on, um, but I think we're going to take, like, one check-in luggage, because I know my mom for sure cannot fit all her stuff inside her luggage, so if we have, like, a carry-on, um, I think it's going to be a little bit cooler in Hawaii right now when we go. So at nighttime, you might need like jackets and sweaters. So uh, I think like extra jackets and sweaters can go into there. Hi, Susu. How are you? It's almost the weekend. I know, Coco. I'm so excited. Oh my gosh. Earlier, John and I went to 85 Degree Bakery. If you guys haven't tried the Strawberry Matcha 85 Degree Bakery, it is one of the best strawberry matchas out there. Um... Better than, like, Starbucks and, like, other places that I've gone. And it's also, like, a lot cheaper. So just get light ice, strawberry matcha. You can substitute the regular milk for oat milk, too, if you're lactose. Um, and it's so, so good. Highly recommend. But make sure to get light ice. Otherwise, they put so much ice and you barely drink anything. Ooh, what's your favorite summer drink? Thank you, Coco. That, like, is perfect. That is our giveaway question. What is your favorite summer drink? Mine is the strawberry matcha right now. I am obsessed. I think I've been getting one of these at least once a week. And they are so, so good. Here is the link for the giveaway. And Susu, thank you so much for all your recommendations. Like, for Hawaii. Amazing. Hi, Lady Badger. John and I were going through it this morning. And, of course, John was looking at all the food places. He was like, ooh, like this Japanese place called, like, um, Ma Mother's or Mom or something. Oh, my gosh. But we love food, so it's okay. One of our favorite things to do on vacation is to eat at new restaurants. I'm going to try and vlog as much as possible when we're there, too. Because... Um, I haven't been vlogging that much and John said he would help me vlog and he would be in the vlogs with me. So it should be fun. And mom's always down for that. 
And I think it's going to be a little bit more of a relaxed vibe in the Philippines or in the Philippines and Hawaii because we're really just there for the wedding and then everything else. We're just going to like fly with the seat of our pants. Hi, Debra. Okay, so leave your answer in the comments of that video. We're giving away this pouch. Ooh, I also got the jalap jalapeno cheese bread. It is so good. I shouldn't be eating carbs right now, but it's okay. You gotta let yourself go sometimes, right? Oh, Deborah, you're in you're in Philadelphia. Nice. Have fun on like visiting. Let me take this out of there. There you go. We'll move that down. Okay, I'll give away question. Oh, that got large. I think the boys are gonna come home pretty soon from school. Today is like haircut day. After the live, I'm cutting, dyeing everyone's hair, doing mom cut and dye, dad cut and dye. I'm gonna cut John's hair. I'm gonna cut Eliza's hair. I'm gonna hopefully have enough time to cut my own hair. So we will see. So it's gonna be a pretty busy day. And I wanna try to finish packing. I did kind of um, get stuff for the trip. We went to the mall yesterday and I did vlog it and I'm gonna see if they want, if my brother and my mom wanna do a haul of the stuff that they got. My mom got such cute stuff to wear to Hawaii. And I really want to film a video, but she's like kind of shy about like clothing hauls. Hi, Dee Dee, how are you? Dee Dee, how's your car? Is it working now? Car stuff is so stressful. We've been taking uh, a bunch of our cars need like oil changes and just like various things. We dropped off the like yesterday we got the an oil change for the Suburban. And then today, I think we dropped off John's car. I don't even know what it's for, what he's getting. I think, oh, I think he's getting new brakes for his car. So a lot of car stuff right now. But Dee Dee, leave your answer to today's question in the comments. I just left it right there of that video. We're giving away this Trina Turk double zip makeup pouch. Super cute. Ooh, nice. Oh, a cruise sounds very relaxing. I hope you have so much fun. Is it true? Like, is, is cruise food good? I always hear, like, it's either, like, it's really good or, like, it's, like, eh, or you get tired of it. But then if it's, like, a short cruise, like, I don't see how you can get tired of all the food because you can't eat everything, right? Like, I feel like there's so many options. Okay. So, I think I'm just going to start off with um, the clothing that my mom gave me. Because she gave me so many cute things. And she's she like, I need to get rid of stuff. Because I just she just bought a bunch of stuff yesterday. And she's like, my closet is going to explode. And then she found this stuff. Which she already put away for me. And it was in a bin. And she forgot to give it to me. And it was like sitting in the bottom of her closet. So... Oh my gosh, Dee Dee, right? Oh gosh, yes. Okay, so this is our first item. Hold on, let me see if... I feel like my lighting is atrocious. Even if I turn this on also, I think we need more like ambient lighting. Okay, this is gonna be... This is gonna be our first item. This is a J. Crew blouse. This is a size extra large. And it has yellow pineapples on it. It's super cute. It has a cap sleeve. Extra large J. Crew pineapple blouse. It's gonna be number one. J Crew Pine Apple Blouse. And this one we're going to do for how much, Adrian? 
Okay, let's just do this one for $10. It's going to be item number one. It's in like new condition. Mom takes really great uh, care of her clothing. So that's going to be item number one is our J. Crew pineapple blouse. I'm going to try to go through the clothing kind of fast because we have a good amount of it. Next up, this is... Oh, this is a new day. I think this is a Target brand. Right? I think a new day is Target, is it? I don't remember. This is a just a yellow blouse. This is a double XL. And it has just flowers. And then it has kind of like this um, crochet detail on the sides. Really pretty. I love the color on this. Blouse with flowers. Double XL. We're going to do this one for $5. It's going to be item number two. Next up. We have... Oh, this is a really pretty Banana Republic blouse. This one is a is a size XL, and it has blue flowers. So pretty. Has sleeves. It's like nice and lightweight, and this is a size XL. So this is gonna be number three. Blue floral banana republic blouse size XL. This one is going to be $10. That's number three. Next up. Oh, this one is really, really cute. I was like, mom. She says it doesn't fit her anymore. <laughs> but this is um, a J. Crew collector's tee, size extra large. And it has these really pretty leaves on it. And it's like a like a dark gray. And then it has a gold outline on the leaves. It's a really, really pretty print size XL. And this is J. Crew. Leaf shirt with dark gray leaves size so we'll do that one for ten dollars as well that's going to be item number three or number four isn't it pretty dgs maybe i'll just do a couple more like clothing pieces and then i'll go to like regular bags and sunglasses and stuff um, this is a really pretty Zara blouse. And it has... It's like a watercolor floral print. And this is a size... Um, it's a U.S. size large. So it's an oversized like size large. Probably like women's XL. Okay, this is our Zara floral blouse, size large, $10. Well, I might actually be able to take a lot of this stuff to like Crossroads too. So that'll be good. Because a lot of this stuff is like really perfect for the season. Um, Hold on. I know there's like some really nice Oh yeah, like this um this banana republic blouse is so pretty. If you guys like lace, this is like a this is a size large. It has like this floral lace design and it's on the front and back. It's really, really cute. And it has like that style like where it looks like there's like a shirt inside of it. Like you're wearing like layers, but it's just on the bottom. Hey Tanya! This is number six. This is our Banana Republic White Floral Lace Top, size large. That's number six. I 
Okay, I think we're going to do one more clothing piece. And then... Um, there was like a really pretty Ted Baker. You have more? <laughs> she gave me even more stuff. Oh, you know, I should do like a posh live sale and sell this stuff. I feel like this uh, like this might sell well on Poshmark. I don't know where they... they were, oh, here's a Ted Baker piece. Um, my mom has some really pretty Ted Baker like clothing pieces. Uh, this is a Ted Baker floral blouse. This like print, like this style print is so in right now too because it's like very 90s. Um, this is a size four. So it's like a size large, extra large. So it's Ted Baker floral blouse, size four. Hey, G-Sweet. And that's going to be our last clothing piece for right now. It's number seven. And that's going to be $10. Okay. Let's go on to some bags now. I know that's what you guys have been waiting for. Let's just... Okay. This is our first item. I think there's more people in here than there were earlier. You guys, leave your answer to today's question. I'm going to leave it in the comments right here of the live chat. Leave your answer in the comments. Don't forget to give the video a thumbs up as well. It always helps the channel immensely. I would greatly appreciate it. So there is that link. We're giving away this Trina Turk double pouch makeup bag. And I have, this is a vintage Made in USA Dooney and Burke tote bag. This is such a great tote. I love these bags. The leather is so, so nice on them. This is a black leather made in USA. The straps are so nice and long too. It sits really nicely on your shoulder. This is the larger version of this bag. I know it also comes in a smaller bag. It does have like um, some like white scuff marks. I know all of that will come off and like this bag will clean up beautifully. If you want me to, I can clean it up and fix it looking really, really nice. It has brass hardware. There's the bottom feet. This is a little buckle to close it up top. Inside is unlined, so it's just suede inside of there. And it is in pretty good shape in the inside. There's no like major like stains or pen marks or anything. It just needs to be vacuumed out. But this is a vintage Dooney and Burke made in USA tote bag in black leather. And this is gonna be item number eight. Vintage Dooney and Burke. Made in USA tote bag with brass hardware. And this is going to be how much, Peter? Okay, we're going to do this one for uh, $65. That's going to be item number eight. 65 Such a cute bag. I actually see this tote, like, fairly often like out like I feel like a lot of a lot of people actually have and wear this bag it's really really nice I think my mom actually owned this bag at one point I think um she gave it to my aunt but yeah Dooney and Burke made in USA it has the little um thing right there this um this bag predates like the little tags on the inside so it doesn't have a tag or the little um hang tag all the stuff is just right here on this little leather patch Next up, I have, oh, this is a Lucky Brand Adop kit. This one's brand new with tags. So it has like the Lucky Brand tags on it. It's a brown canvas, and then it has a brown leather trim, and it has a zipper pocket here on the front, and then it has two 
zippered main compartment. Um, the back compartment has a zipper, and then there's another zipper in the back. So this has a lot of storage options. Really great travel bag. <laughs> Didi, be strong, Didi. This is number nine. This is our brown canvas and leather Lucky brand. Um, what is it called? A dock kit? How do you spell dock? D O P P? Dock kit. Um, new with tabs. And this one's going to be how much, Peter? Okay, we're going to do this one for. Let's just do 15 bucks. 15. That's going to be item number nine. This is brand new. Next up is number 10. Oh, DG House is calling it. Congratulations, DG House. That one is going to you. Yay. Oh! That guy over here. Oh, this next piece is really, really cute. Um, this is a Ted Baker. And it's a Ted Baker Kiss Lock uh, crossbody bag. The crossbody strap is actually inside. So it's um, it has rose gold hardware. And then the leather is like a lavender color. It does have some slight rubbing on the corners right here of the piping on one side. The other side is in pretty good shape. Um, inside does have... Looks like four built-in card slots, and there's a zipper pocket right there. The interior lining is nice and clean. Um, the Tory Birch. Oh, was it the was it the drawstring bag? I'll actually show that one next. Um, essay if you wanted to see that one. So that is gonna be this guy right here. This is our Ted Baker. The crossbody strap, the chain, is also removable, so you can just use this as a little um. You can even use this like a little wallet or just a little clutch to go out. It's really, really cute. So this is Ted Baker, number 10, our lavender leather Ted Baker kiss lock bag with rose gold hardware. And this is going to be Okay, let's do 45 on this guy. That's going to be item number 10. Oh, essay, yes. I can put it on um, on Poshmark for you. We can do it at the end of the, end of the sale, or I can send you, um, it's a PayPal invoice. But let me show you the bag really quickly. Just to make sure we got the right one for you. And it is this gorgeous baby right here. This is a Tory Burch blue leather bucket drawstring bag. It's quilted. I love these like opaque blue jewels right there. And they have like gold as well. So pretty. The crossbody strap is removable. It's not adjustable. Hardware is gold. It's so cute, right? In comparison to cell phone, I have the largest iPhone. This will fit inside just like that. My little angel baby sticks up at the top. Ah, and it's stuck to me. Actually, Victor, you want to take a screenshot of it, and then you can post it on Poshmark right now, if you want. Yeah. Um, I say the only thing is on Poshmark, we have to raise the price just a little bit more than we would during the lives for um, an invoice, just because Posh charges a little bit more extra for them. But this is going to be um, our Tory Birch drawstring... 
crossbody bag with gold hardware and jewels. And this is how much, Peter? Okay, this one is $110. We could probably do like what, like one, yeah. On Poshmark, um, we we can list it at one twenty if that's okay. Okay, so that's number eleven. Next up, we have. Uh, Oh, and so you don't need um you don't need like access to a PayPal account. You just check out as a guest and you just use your debit or credit card and just type it just type in your address. You don't need to have an actual account for PayPal. Just um send me an email and then if you have if it's too much trouble, we can always just put it on Poshmark as well. Yeah, so just send me an email. My email address is right right there. And at the end of the live sale, we'll send you an invoice. And then if, you, if, it's, if it's like too difficult to do on there, we can, just, we can always just post it on Poshmark. That's no problem. Okay, um, next up. Oh, I actually have a couple other things on Poshmark too. We've listed, um, we've updated our Poshmark and Depop recently and Mercari. So there's stuff listed up there as well. Uh, next up, we have, oh, let's do, $110 on PayPal, and then shipping's gonna be $10, SA. And that doesn't have, like, any of the, like, all, the, that's, that's pretty much it, then there's, like, a very small, um, PayPal tax, I think, but it's it comes out a lot cheaper than on um, Poshmark. This is our Jimmy Choo belt. It has silver hardware and it's like jeweled and it says Choo. And then the leather is this really pretty purple suede. And this is in like new condition. This is a size large. This belt is made in Italy and it's in really, really great condition. It is such a a cute belt. I am like obsessed with it. It's so, so cute. And this is going to be item number 12. This is our purple. My mom is so sad this belt doesn't fit her. She's like, it's so cute. And this is how much we are doing? Okay, this one is. Actually, it's good. Let's do a little discount. We're going to do $75 for the Jimmy Choo belt. It's in like new condition. That's going to be item number 12. 13 is next. I know, Dee Dee, I can't even fit it on my waist. It's a women's large. So I think it, it fits like um up to like a size 30 inch waist. It does not fit my 34 inch waist, unfortunately. Oh, are you sending me the thing about your doll beatering? I knew it. All right, next up, we have number 13, and it is this a beautiful coach tabby. This is the pillow, or the quilted um, tabby. Silver hardware. This is in like new condition. This also comes with the original purchase receipt as well. And the dust bag, there is a nice pocket in the back which has a magnetic snap original hang tag right there you can wear this as a shoulder bag or as a cross body front opens up there's another pocket right here i love that there's this pocket and it's magnetic it's really really nice um this is made of napa leather which is so so soft this is a great compartment right there there's a middle dividing zipper pocket and then there's two other like spaces right there and inside the middle i have the the dust bag and the receipt and everything is inside of there thank you maria isn't it pretty 
Uh oh, I got the I got the zipper stuck on the drawstring. There you go. But it's in like new condition. It is such a gorgeous bag. This is the the tabby twenty six. Is the size which I think is the perfect size for this. Look at that. It is so cute. The length, like the drop length is perfect too. It sits right at my hip. For reference, I'm about 5'7". Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Here is my phone in comparison to the bag as well. All right, so this is number 13. This is our black quilted coach tabby with silver hardware. Oh, I'm so glad you like it, Susu. The photo that you sent this morning with your shoes, they match perfectly. So I'm very happy. Okay, uh, silver hardware. Use condition. Dust bag and um, original receipt included. And we're going to do a little discount on this one. We're going to do $425. That's going to be item number 13. She is beautiful. Okay, so that's number 13. Four twenty-five. Next up, we have 14. Shoulder, gorgeous. Okay, our next item is this is a oh no, let's knock something over. This is a black fossil messenger um messenger crossbody bag. It has silver hardware. It's leather. Sorry, it's a little squished and creased, but black leather. It, the top flap is magnetic. And then when you open it up, there's a nice big pocket here in the front. You got a laptop sleeve in the back, which is padded. And then inside, you have a big zipper pocket right there. And then on the other side, you have... There's four pen pockets, and then there's three larger slip pockets. There's a ton of compartments in this bag. The Great Messenger. The this crossbody strap also is adjustable. And this will fit up to a 15 inch laptop. Oh yeah, Courtney, of course. Okay, so this is our black fossil messenger crossbody bag with silver hardware. How much is it even? Okay, we're gonna do this one for forty dollars for our black fossil crossbody. That's number fourteen. And let me pull out that Ted Baker to show you really quickly, Courtney. Where is it? Where did I put it? Oh, Didi, congrats. Yay. Yay! That is such a good bag. Congrats, Didi. Oh, DG House. I'm sorry. Didi called that one right before you. But this is that um, Ted Baker. It's so cute. It's like a lavender color leather. It has rose gold hardware. And then it has the TB um, right up top, right there. And it's has a crossbody chain strap. This is removable as well. And then in the interior, you have four built-in card slots, and then you have a little zipper pocket right there. There is a little bit of rubbing on the exterior um, piping on one side. So right here, there's a little bit of rubbing of the leather. Nothing too crazy, but there is some rubbing right there. There's no stains on the inside, and the rest of the leather is in pretty 
great condition. It's super cute. And this was how much, Adrian, for the Ted Baker? Um, and this one was $45, if you're interested, Courtney. So that's our Ted Baker kiss lock. You're welcome, Courtney. Let me know if you have any more questions. All right, next up, we have number 15. Okay. Oh, this is a really cute bag. This is the first time um, I've gotten this brand before. And the brand is called Berkley. Um, it's B-U-R-K-E-L-Y. And this is a orange like hobo bag, but it actually turns into a backpack. So the straps turn into a backpack. It's so, so cute. I love the style. The leather is a super soft, like orange vegetable dyed leather. It says Berkeley right there on the uh, on the little hang tag, and there's a I think it's a Jaguar on there, and there's a front pocket right here with a little magnetic snap. There's a zipper pocket here in the back, perfect for like your cell phone or whatever, and. You can actually also make this into a crossbody bag. You just have to take off the straps right here and then reattach up top and then you have a crossbody. So you can wear the crossbody as a shoulder or as a backpack. It's a really, really versatile bag. Then you get into the main interior of the bag. You have one zipper pocket right there. Isn't it so cool, Courtney? I believe this backpack retails for around 200 or more dollars. And then there's two pockets right here and they do have um the pocket portions like it's actually like a printed leather that's a leopard print and that goes with the li their little leather um tag that has the leopard on it so i thought that was a really cute touch um the leather's in pretty good shape there might be some slight patinaing like a li little bit more patina on the back it's a vegetable dyed leather so it will um, get lighter and darker in some spots over time, but I think it's pretty even throughout other than there's like a couple little spots on the back I don't even think it's like that noticeable. There's a mark right there and a couple little things just right there, but the front Is pretty nice and even and if you wanted to even it out I think like a good coat of con leather conditioner will even out the whole thing But that is our bag. This is how it looks as a shoulder bag it's like super soft super squishy and that is number 15 how do i spell i keep like berkeley i keep wanting to spell it like berkeley like the school or the place um hobo honey with antique silver hardware and this is how much peter Okay, we're gonna do this one for forty dollars. Hobo. Oh, Hobo International is so nice, Courtney. I love it too. They make such wonderful leather goods, especially like their wallets. Their wallets are like the um, I think it's called the Lauren wallet. It's their most popular one. That one is such a good wallet. My mom had one for years, and she was like obsessed with it. Okay, next up, we got number 16. We got, this is a Gucci um, fold-over clutch. Right, Courtney? I agree. Yes. It's kind of like a metallic leather. Uh, it's like a taupey brown. And it's like has like a metallic pearlescent sheen to it. Um, it has bamboo details. The zipper pull has the bamboo with the tassel. And the little turn lock right here also is bamboo. And then it has like a really light gold hardware. It looks almost silver. And you open it up. 
it's cool on the inside. Let me just take it out. You got a six card slots and then there's a slip pocket right there. And then on the other side, you have like three makeup, like lipstick pockets. And then you have like a bigger one for whatever else you wanted to put in there. So I thought that was really cool. And these are um, stretchy. So they'll definitely hold whatever you wanted to put in there. And then the Gucci tag is right there. There's a little serial number underneath. It does have some slight discoloration just right there, but it's very minimal. You don't even see it when it's inside. It's inside the crease, uh, like the fabric on the inside. And then it just like folds over. It's super cute. And this is gonna be number 16, metallic, pearlescent, brown taupe leather Gucci fold over clutch with light gold hardware bamboo accents and this one okay we had this one at 250 we're gonna do a good discount today let's do 220 and that's number 16. So cute, it's like a nice little clutch. Is it just me? I feel like it just got hot. I think the sun just came out. What time? Oh, it's lunch time now. All right, next up we have, it's supposed to be 75 degrees today. Sunday is going to be 80 degrees. It's going to be nice and warm on Sunday. Okay. 17 is next. And we have, this is a red Zadig and Voltaire crossbody bag. This one is so cute. It's a double zip crossbody bag so it has two separate pouches um and then it does zip all the way around on both pouches so that they can expand a little bit and then the expanding leather piece inside is actually a metallic silver it's so cool that's on both sides and then the hardware for the zipper is really cool because it has different colored hardware and it has like a brass rose gold gunmetal silver so it's really really cool you see that on all the zipper tees and then it does also come with the original dust bag on the inside and then interior of both pockets or compartments are just open. There's no other pockets or anything inside of them. And they are a pretty good size. They will fit my phone if it didn't have the little baby angel on it. Actually, even with the angel, it fits inside. So it still fits even with a baby. Baby pops out. <laughs> like that. Oh, Eliza's here. You want Hi. some jalapeno bread, baby? No, thanks. No? Look it. Do you like my little baby? <laughs> okay. It's an apple. Okay, I also have this. Okay. <laughs> what is it? A mouse. You like it? Yeah. Are you thinking about taking it? No. Are you going to put it on your iPad? No. <gasps> How's your arm? Oh, show everyone your arm. Someone got his cast off. Yay! Are you excited about it? How come you're not wearing your other one? It's your a soft, splint. Your soft splint. How come you're not wearing it? I'm not doing anything right now. Oh. Are we going to cut your hair later? No. Yeah, remember? We're cutting your hair a little bit. We're giving you a trim. Okay. Are we gonna Are we gonna cut off all Eliza's hair? No. How much should we cut off? Like like this much? This much? Nah. This much? Nah. Just a little bit like this? Yeah. Okay. We're cutting we're giving Eliza a haircut today. How's school? Good. 
Oh, I like your shirt. It has a dinosaur. Mm. Are you going to have lunch? This is my giant baby. Or are you a little baby? Your giant baby or a little baby? Mm-hmm. Little baby? Go. Oh, I got you guys bread. Bread? Yeah. Your favorite bread from 85 Baby Bakery. Ask Uncle John where he put it. Because I think he might have taken it to his it's, room so he can eat it. No, he did not. It's on the dining room. Oh, okay, go eat some. I got your favorite bread. It's over there. Thanks. <laughs> All right. Um, so this is our red Zedig and Voltaire. Sorry, I got sidetracked. Red Zedig. And it comes with a dust bag as well. And the extra leather is in pretty good shape. I think there's just like very minor rubbing on like the back corners right there. But it's otherwise it's in really great shape. This is number 12, our red, or seven, did I say 12? Number 17, red Zedig. <gasps> Eliza's back. And Voltaire, double cross body bag with silver multi-colored hardware. And we're going to do how much for you, Okay, we're going to do this one for 85 We're going to do $10 off. We had a 95 That's going to be item number 17. Thanks, Courtney. Hey, did you do your homework, baby? I'm almost done. You're it? almost done? Yeah. Oh. <gasps> I'm sorry, there's no way around it, baby. We can't do recess either this time. <gasps> oh, no recess. Eliza can't do any strenuous activities after his cast got removed. You have to wait a few weeks still? Three weeks. Three weeks? Let yeah. me smell your... Ugh. This is so bad we watched it. Just kidding, it. it smells delicious. You're letting it breathe. You were letting it time. breathe? Yeah. Oh. The doctor said as long as he's just sitting there, he can have it off. <gasps> oh, you're just going to sit down and be calm? He's doing yeah. homework. Oh, you're doing homework. Yeah. Okay. Hmm, my Come little angel. All right, next is number, oh, number 18. Okay, I have, this is a anthropology vase. I was going to keep it, but I'm like, Adrian, you can't keep the ball. So we're going to let this one go. Even though it is yellow, my favorite color, and it has a purple, um, it looks like a lavender, no, iris. I don't remember what kind of flower this is. Purple flower, really, really pretty. It's in great shape. Anthropology, floral vase, yellow with purple flower. So this is going to be number 18, anthropology, yellow vase with purple flower. And these are like discontinued. I know they're super popular. People collect them. Um, this is going to be how much, Peter? Okay, we're doing this one for $25. This is going to be number 18. For our anthropology vase, it's so pretty. Next up, we got 19. Okay. There's a div, it's right there. Also, don't forget to enter the giveaway. I'm going to leave that link one more time. Oh, Jack didn't come to say hi. He just got back from school, too. So there's that link. Enter the giveaway. We're giving away this Trina Turk pouch today. Next up, we got 19. He's attacking that baby reader. Next up, these are a pair of Fendi aviators. They have gray lenses, silver hardware. They have like a little mini visor on top. It's blue and then it says Fendi. 
this is how they look on they're super duper cute they have like little tan like ends on the arms and then it has like a little f cut out and they do say fendi on the sides as well yeah they're in pretty good shape the lenses have very minor marks on them and yeah like very minor like marks on the hardware it's really great a great shape too these are number 19 these are fendi aviators silver with a blue visor and these are how much adrian Okay, we're doing these for $110. And that's going to be item number 19. They have little nose pieces too. I love sunglasses that have a nose piece because I don't have much of a nose bridge. And these sunglasses need to stay on my face. But see what I was telling you guys about this pouch? Like, it's such a good, like, you can put your sunglasses in there. And they're like, they're like separated and they're kind of padded as well. So if you had like multiple kinds of glasses, you can put them in here and like they're going to be protected. So I like that. All right, next up, number 20, we have... This is our Vintage Coach Quartz Crossbody Bag. This is made in Turkey, black leather, brass hardware. It's just missing the hang tag. Otherwise, it's in a really, really great condition. There's a back pocket right here. Hardware. The crossbody strap is removable and adjustable. You have a turn lock. When you open it up, it has a pocket right here in the front. And then it has just one zipper on the inside. Right, Kristen? This is such a cute bag. Court crossbody. Little top handle. The leather is actually in really great shape. It just needs a really good, like, conditioning and cleaning. But it's in pretty good condition as is. Like, it would be good already just like it is right now. Hey, Finding Solace. How are you? This is our black... Coach Court Vintage made in Turkey Brass Hardware. Okay, we're doing this one for $85. It's gonna be item number 20. Alright, 21 is next. Cute, Coach Court. Why is my sweater getting so dirty? What am I happy? You sure did, Finding Solace. How are you? Does anyone have anything fun planned for the rest of the day? Anything fun happening today? Oh, any fun plans for the weekend? On Sunday, my cousin, my cousin's baby is having a birthday and it's going to be like a little bowling birthday. So it's going to be so much fun. So that's what we're doing on, on Sunday. You guys, I had this bag and I lost the hardware for it because I was like, oh my gosh, it used to be attached. And then it became unattached. But then I found the hardware on the floor of the car and I was like, oh my gosh, there's that little piece. And I keep forgetting to reattach it. So we're going to do that. 
right now if I can find where I put it. Wait, now the hardware is gone. Adrian, you lost it. Oh my gosh, you do have it. I'm so mad at you. I was literally going to attach it. I had this dramatic story. And <laughs> it's gone. <laughs> Vaderine stole my hardware. But I have the hardware. This is the other piece of the crossbody strap. I have the, the screw that goes into it. So I'm going to keep it inside of this bag in the zipper pocket. Vaderine will reattach it if anyone buys it. But oh, nice! Wait, is that today, um, Didi? You guys gotta give Didi a follow. She's on YouTube. She's on Instagram. She is everywhere. We love her, and she's been doing like this really fun like series on her YouTube channel. She has like all these guests that come on that also love handbags and she is just amazing. Okay, so tonight you guys, turn on your notifications. Make sure to give DD a follow here on YouTube, 11 p.m. Central Standard Time. She's doing a live with Joy Love C from Singapore. How fun, so international, I love it. What are you guys talking about tonight, Didi? Mikowski Satchel. Oh my gosh, Didi, I'm so sorry. When I get back from Hawaii, though, Didi, we, we're going to do a live together. I'm just like all over. I've been all over the place. Um, B. Mikowski Satchel. This is like a Himalayan, like crocodile balls, like the Himalayan Birkin. But this is not a real crocodile. It is leather, it's just embossed. Uh, it has rose gold hardware. It has this removable, uh, well, not removable. It has this little mirror attached to it, which is so cute. Oh, how difficult it is. To yeah, it is so hard to shop drops. <gasps> Kristen! Oh my gosh. Oh, the new... Okay, so I'm going to try to film this tomorrow. I don't know if I'm going to be able to, but I will take as much video on my phone as I can. But tomorrow is actually the grand opening of the Bagu store in LA, and I'm going. So I'm really, really excited. I also heard that they're doing some of the dead stock items too when during the grand opening. So I'm hoping to get... I'm hoping to get some cool like dead stock stuff i really want like the leather large crescent bag that'll be a really good one to get um i might pick up a couple other pieces i kind of want some packing cubes too so tomorrow might be the day for that as well i think that'll be helpful for when i go to hawaii on monday but yeah the bagu store finally opens in la tomorrow so i'm really excited I know, Kristen. Oh my gosh, how many bags do you have? I don't have too many. I have like one, two, three, four, five. I might have like seven or eight bagu bags. I love them. Um, oh, how much is this bag, Adrian? For the <laughs> B. Mikowski? <laughs> okay, the B. Mikowski is going to be $40, you guys. $40. Um, like I said, we will have the crossbody or the longer strap attached to it. Vadrian kept the little piece that it had on there. But it is a beautiful bag. It's in really great shape. Top handle, the longer strap attaches on the sides. Oh, nice. Kristen, that is, that is a good number. Do you have, um, oh, Lady Badger's call number 21. Congrats, Lady Badger. Yay. Kristen, what's, like, your favorite bag? Or, like, do you have, like, a rare, like, any cool, like, rare dead stock ones, too? Or any leather pieces? 
I regret, like, I've had leather pieces in the past, and I've sold all of them. And I'm just, like, kind of sad about it. I feel like I should have just kept them. My fiance. <laughs> That's what they're there for, to say otherwise. Well, congrats, Lady Badger. This is a beautiful bag. Trippy checker. Oh, nice. That's the, the like the, like that, the checker print looks like it's like melting or something, right? Like it's kind of like, that's a cool one. I like that design. I'm dying for the leather one too, Kristen. I really, I really want to get the press, like the crescent one, the really big one. Okay, next up. We have We have, this is the navy blue Monsoor Gabrielle tote bag. This bag is so beautiful. It's like a smooth leather. It does have some really light, like, marks. I don't know if they're really showing. They almost look like a, like, like lines. Like, there's like a hor not horizontal, horizontal lines right there. Um... A Dodo Bird is calling number 20. Congratulations, Dodo Bird. That's our vintage uh, code. Oh! Bag. Congratulations. Oh! Also, hi, Dodo Bird. How are you? But congrats. That one's going to you. Um. Yeah, but that's on one side. The other side, the front side is in really, really great condition. It just says Monster Gabrielle in gold right there. The interior is a really pretty, like, blue. And the little Made in Italy tag, you see that little white tag is right there on the, on the inside right there. But she is a beauty. Just simple... Top handles are long enough to carry on your shoulder, even if you're wearing a thick sweater. That's number 22, our navy blue. Monsoor. I cannot type. Gabrielle. Tote bag with blue interior. And this one's how much for you Ooh, okay, we had this one at one fifty. Let's do a really good discount on this one. We're gonna do one hundred and ten dollars today for this month's with Gabrielle. That's gonna be number twenty two, one hundred and ten dollars. Month's with Gabrielle, beautiful, gorgeous. Right, DG House. It is such a good tote bag. It's a good one. And it's nice and lightweight, too. All right, next item we're going to do is 23. Jose, oh, are you talking about the, the, the metallic one? Um, it is still available. I just don't have it with me. Vadrian has it. Um, but it is still available if you want it. Um, and Finding Solace, I do have a quilted tabby. Isn't it beautiful? It's a tabby 26, silver hardware. It's in like new condition, comes with the dust bag and the original receipt of purchase as well. Has a hang tag right there also. Such a beautiful bag. But yes, yeah, so if you let me know if you want it. I just don't have it currently with me, but it is still available. Um, Vadrian sent me a photo of it because Vadrian's holding it hostage. Here's a photo of it. Right there. Uh, 
All right. Fine. Okay. Don't have a good rest of your day at work, Dodo Bird. Thanks for coming in and congrats on the bag. So yeah, Jose, we do have that bag. So just let me know if you want it. Um, how much was it, Adrian? And then this is that Coach um, Tabby bag. This one is four twenty-five. And it's number 13, if anyone's interested in the Coach Tabby. I know, Kristen, Finding Solace. I was, like, dead when I saw it. I wish I could do it cheaper, but it was... Um, I had to pay up for it. But it's a beautiful one. And I think, like, um, with tax and everything, this bag went for over $600 on the receipt. It was actually purchased in L.A., too. The coach. Okay, yeah. So the coach camera bag, Jose. That one is 130 if you're interested. That is number 23. Metallic leather coach camera bag. 130 if you're interested. I know. I, I know this like this bag sells like on Poshmark. Especially with the silver hardware. I really love it with the silver. It's so cute. It's so like Chanel-esque too yeah 550 retail yep 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 um here's the i think this was purchased in glendale yeah at the glendale galleria Oh, that is an amazing gift, Jose. Congratulations. Yay. We're going to make sure to wrap it up really nice for her. Congratulations. Aw. I got goosebumps. That is so sweet. I love that. All right. Ooh, Jose, if you want us to include, like, a little card or something, this goes for everyone. If you're ever sending anyone, like, a gift and you want us to, like, ship it to them and you want us to, like, include a card, just send me an email with, like, what you want on the card and then we can do that. Just make sure that when you check out, um, make sure to have that address on there. Because when you check out, you can put, like, you can have it mailed to whatever address you want. Just make sure you have it set to that address and we can do that for you. Well, I know Vivian is going to his house, but that, I mean, like, if it's, if it's like a gift for someone else, like, ever. You know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> Vivian's like, it's his wife is probably getting shipped to the same place. I'm like, you know, just for future reference. Like, if it's a gift for someone else. Yeah, we can gift wrap, too. <laughs> We'll make it really nice for you, Jose. She's going to love it. Okay. Um, next up is 24. You guys already know, like, Vedrine is, like, so amazing at packaging. Like, every pre every package is, like, a present, so... Oh, I also have, this is another um, brand new coach that I have. This is the Rainbow Coach Backpack. It's so cute. It's the multi-rainbow color coach monogram with golden brown leather trim. And then the straps are like, so fun, also rainbow. And the special rainbow coach hang tag right there as well. There's a front pocket, magnetic, top flap magnetic, and then there's a drawstring. It still has a lot of, like, the original packaging with it, too. Like the, uh, what is it called? The styrofoam and all that stuff. The inside has all the original packaging as well. I just don't have a dust bag for this one. But there's one zipper pocket and then an open pocket on the interior. There's the original Jellica packing as well. 
I almost fell off the chair. <laughs> oh my gosh. One day I'm gonna fall off this chair. And this little coach rainbow bag is how much Adrian for the backpack? Okay. So this is our rainbow coach backpack. We're asking 125. This one is in like new condition. That's number 24. Right, it's so cool. I like the straps. It's very fun. It's like a little mini backpack. Why am I so sweaty right now? It's like hot. Oh, I was looking for this strap. Yeah. Other side. Okay, next up I have, this is a Dagny Dover. Um, I think this is the essential tote, simple tote. I forgot the name or the basic tote, but this is from their core collection. This is in a light pink leather. It has the nice long top handle. This is like the perfect travel bag. It'll hold so, so much. It even has the removable drink cup holder right inside of there. There's a laptop sleeve right here for a 13 inch laptop. You got phone pocket, pen pockets, card slots. There's an extra zipper. It does have um, like a slight perfume scent to the interior and the exterior does have some slight discoloration as well, just from regular use. But I feel like this has so much life left. This is actually a great bag to, if you want to practice like dyeing something, this would be a really easy one. You can dye it almost any color or you can paint it any color as well. And this is in a sturdy caviar type leather. It's really great. So just the top panels. This one doesn't have a crossbody strap. Um, this is going to be item number 25. This one's going to be as is. So this is a light pink Dagny Dover tote bag with gold hardware and this one's gonna be how much Adrian? okay we're gonna do forty dollars on this one <laughs> finding solace uh isn't that that's that's yeah understandable Oh my, I was just going to say, like, it was just, it's like tax week, like taxes were due on Monday. So I get it. I accidentally, I, I made the mistake of going to the post office on Monday because I forgot that it was tax day. Oh my gosh. Did I tell you about this? How crazy it was at the post office? Like, okay, I got there. I was driving up and I saw like, there are at least six cop cars in front of the post office and like the whole parking lot was filled and I was like what is happening at the post office and then there was like a lady with her stroller like sitting in the front with like a group of policemen around her and then there was another lady at the front door who was selling flowers and then she had like two police officers talking to her and then there was like a line of people out the door trying to drop off their taxes and I was just trying to buy stamps for my mom because she was like I need some stamps and I was like okay luckily the line for the kiosk like in the machines was like really short i was in and out but i almost got hit like five times in the parking lot by cars that were just like whizzing through it was crazy and i think what happened with the uh the police is there's actually like a roving band of um like i i don't know if that's it, is it politically correct to call them gypsies travelers i don't know what they are but they're like people that like panhandle um outside of like the grocery store or the post office um anywhere and 
they're they actually um like their ringleader or something like i saw it in the news was caught in our town and was like put in jail but like a lot of them are still here and they are they are just like everywhere it's crazy but not as much anymore ever since like the but this was the first time i saw them again at the post office but i think that's what happened because i I heard people talking about it inside the post office because everyone was gossipy while waiting in line so yeah but that was 25 or dacne dober tote bag Vadrian, leave me alone. Oh, can I show you guys this? I got one of those little blind boxes yesterday, and it is the cutest little duck, and he's a potato, and he's in a potato box. He's so cute. I wish I could turn this into a keychain, but he's kind of heavy and kind of big. Imagine this has a keychain, Vadrian. It would be so adorable. All right, next up is 26. Do you guys want to see more clothing? Oh, uh, thank you, Dee Dee. Um, but let me leave the link again for the giveaway. For anyone that would like to enter. I might have to, you know, I think I'm just going to go to, th actually, should we end right now at 25? That's a nice round number. Um, I need to start getting on haircuts. So I think we should just end it right now. I also, it's also lunchtime. So um, I might be back later. I need to organize these clothes that my mom gave me. I might do just like a clothing sale. If anyone's interested, um, mom's clothes are, I think she also has shoes. So she's a size eight and a half, nine, and then clothing will be large, extra large, or double XL. Um, I might do, I might come back later on once I'm done cutting and dyeing everyone's hair and organizing everything because everything's kind of just a mess right now. Um, but yeah, actually, yeah, that's it for today. We'll be back later. Um... It'll just be like a surprise. It'll be before... <gasps> I'll come on before Dee Dee comes on. Because Dee Dee's having hers at 10. Or 9? At 9. 10? 11? I think it's 10 o'clock my time. It's 10 o'clock my time. It's 11 Central Standard Time. So um, I'll try to be on before then. And then we'll pre-game. We're going to pre-game. We're going to pre-party until um, Dee Dee's live. Because I, I really want to see that. I think that's so interesting, like, trying to get drops, like, internationally. So, I will be back. I just have a lot I have to do first. And I just want to make sure I get that stuff done. Yes! Okay, perfect. So, we're going to we're gonna pre-party before DD. I'll be back later. I don't exactly know what time. Um, maybe 8 or 9 um, p.m. Pacific time will be when I come up. So, leave your answer to today's giveaway question right there. And we're going to pick our winner in just a second. And then um, invoices should be sent out within the next 10, 15 minutes after the live ends. Uh, and then I will be back tonight with all the clothes. I just want to organize them because my mom kind of just, I kind of just like took them all in a giant pile and I have no clue what anything is. We, I know she gave me a lot of um, summer dresses, summer blouses. I don't think she gave me too many, like, pants at all. I think they're all just tops and dresses, so. And they're all, like, springy, summery, get your guys' closets ready for a fun um, summer outfit. What happened, Vader? Oh. I love her. Right? Yeah. Dee Dee has such fun videos. Oh, um, Kirsten, you leave it in the answer. You leave it in the comments of the video that I linked right there. Um, 
I unfortunately you can't leave like I can't use the the random comment picker on like in the live chat or like there's no you can't leave comments on the live video itself. So it was this morning's YouTube video that I had up on my channel. Leave your answer right there, and then we'll pick our winner. Um, from there in just a few moments. And while we are waiting, let me actually get Dee Dee's YouTube so that I can leave that for you guys to check out. Where are you, Dee Dee? Oh, there you are, Dee Dee Bean. Uh, dun, dun, dun. Okay, I'm gonna leave the link for her YouTube channel right here. Please make sure to give her a follow. She's amazing. <laughs> oh yeah, Eliza, <laughs> we made cookies at the end of that vlog. Aw, oh, thank you, Fighting Solace. But that's Dee Dee's um, YouTube channel. Please give her a follow. She's almost to 1,000 subscribers, which is so awesome. 709 subscribers. Amazing. And then um, she is doing her live today at 11 p.m. Central Standard Time. So that's 10 p.m. Um, West Coast. And then that's midnight um, Eastern. You're welcome, Dee Dee. Handbag. <laughs> All right, but we're going to pick our winner now. Um, in three, two, one. Do, 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 do. Our winner is <laughs> it's Dee Dee. Hey, Dee Dee, if this is, I think this is your second time in a row winning. Favorite summer drink is pina colada. Ooh. I'm allergic to alcohol, but I love a virgin pina colada. But congratulations, Didi. This is perfect. A cute little double zip pouch. Congratulations. Um, again, don't forget to follow Didi. It's all about Didi today. That's so funny. She won. The, I, yeah, I think you won last live, right? But congratulations, Didi. Um, don't forget to join her tonight at 11 p.m. Central Standard Time. I'll be up again at 8 or 9 Pacific time, so an hour or two hours before Dee Dee goes. And then we can do a little live sale or hang out and pre-party until Dee Dee goes on. Uh, but that's it for right now. I got to go. I got a ton of stuff I got to get done. Thank you guys immensely for hanging out with me. And I'll see you guys all later. Bye, guys. Adios.